This cell features a great variety of works of art from all countries across Asia, from an imperial seal of the estate of Emil Guimet to great jade carvings, very interesting group of ceramics from China to superlative Buddhist culture. This cell is one of the most exciting Sotheby's ever assembled in this category in Paris. The sale includes a truly exceptional group of gilt bronze sculptures that were originally created to decorate stupas at the Denstal Monastery in Tibet in the late 14th century. The first of these gilt bronzes depicts Hayagriva. Originally a Hindu deity, an avatar of the god Vishnu, he was assimilated into Tibetan Buddhism as a wrathful deity. It's very rare to find him in this form as a winged deity, and really this is the, the pinnacle of quality of what one finds from Denstal sculpture. The next three sculptures depict the tantric deity Vajavarahi, a female deity depicted holding a skull cap and dancing on a corpse. It's extraordinary to have three. This next depicts Nagaraja, this wonderful Randall, depicting the divine being associated with the cosmic ocean and guardian of Buddhism. There are other very close examples shown in the 1948 photos of Denstil, but it's truly remarkable to have one here preserved in such good condition. This magnificent large sculpture depicts Shakyamuni Buddha in a posture of meditation relating to the specific moment in his biography when he summoned the earth spirit to bear witness to his triumph over the demon Mara. It's a large late Ming gilt bird of exceptional size and very powerful crisp quality, drawing on the classical Chinese tradition. Other highlights of the sale include an extraordinary selection of Chinese jades, a rare large inscribed jade Buddha depicting the Qianlong Emperor's favorite tea house retreat two fantastic jade animal figures from a French private collection acquired in China in the 19th century. And one of my favorite pieces in the sale is this imperial white jade dragon seal of the Jiaqing Emperor. It was once held by the Jiaqing Emperor and it was made for his personal use. And this seal was formerly in the collection of Emil Guimet, the founder of the most celebrated museum of Asian art in France. And it's appearing in the market for the very first time.